everybody welcome back to what to wear here and there and if you are new here welcome 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 i am your gracious host lashana and in today's video it's even better than three ways to wear it because right now i'm just telling you that the denim trend is highly on the rise it's actually not on the rise it's here 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 so what I thought I'd do today was share with you seven days of denim looks okay so I know we all have a ton a ton a ton of denim and right now guys like I said it's all the rage I mean you can just shop your closet you don't have to go out looking in the stores but I am just here to share seven days of denim looks for all of the ladies who are very much into high-low style with flair, okay? I don't know, we, do we need to come up with a little uh, term for those of us who are over here hanging out with me? I don't know, I, I don't have like a, a catchphrase, like you know those really beautiful influencers. There's one that I love, um, her name is Shelly. I think she calls her her friends and followers seashells or whatever. But we don't have that over here. My my good girlfriend, um, Micheline, she of Hot Millennial, she calls us icons. Okay, so anyway, I was just <laughs> thinking in my head as I was chatting here with you, good girlfriends and gents, whoever's watching, that um, I don't know. We're gonna start, I don't know if this is gonna be a series, but this is seven days of denim. So if that's something that you're interested in, grab your coffee, your chai tea latte, or a bottle of water and stay along for the ride. But first, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, save for future inspiration or entertainment, uh, share with a friend or a loved one, you know, cause, <laughs> I, I need to grow guys. The only way to grow is if you share and you comment and like and save. I'm not begging, but I'm just sh sharing with you all who are maybe not too familiar with how this works. Anyway, let me go on. I told you guys before in one of the last videos that I'm a little bit silly sometimes, especially when I get in front of the camera. I don't know why, but we are going to take a look at uh, a few of these looks here and one of the looks I'm wearing you really can't tell too much I'm looking at the viewfinder there but this is a, an, a distressed oversized denim jacket um, I actually stole this from my daughter or borrowed it um, because and I'm looking down at my phone to pull up the looks <sighs> she just was not into it anymore um, so I thought I put together a nice look with this denim jacket that you will see I guess I'm gonna put it over here um, or here whichever way you guys will see it when I put it up um, she was over it so I said well I can put that together with a really cool look so as you're seeing here I have put it with let me put on my trusty trusty glasses um, this really cute denim dress it is a little small on the top portion for, for my liking, <laughs> to be modest. So this jacket was really great for that. Um, I actually deconstructed a denim belt that I purchased from Amazon and just used that as the tie. And oh my gosh, I can't wait. And I'm gonna be sharing later in a future video about these amazing Casade or Casade uh, Python pumps that I was sent um, through Modesense, um, and they are just to live for, ladies. So anyway, um, simple, easy. This, I think, is like a medium wash denim, um, and I will try to put links um, down to everything that I have, but guys, I really shopped my closet on this one, so um, <clears throat> take a peek um at the description box below um and i will share with you if i can remember where i got them if it was like within range like within a few weeks to months um this dress actually i got two years ago and it's from the j lux label 
The denim jacket, I have no idea, but given that my daughter shops Shein so much, it's probably Shein, but it is so well made. It's so sturdy. You guys know I've done some Shein review before. The things that I've purchased, are, you know, are still hanging in there. Okay, so <clears throat> seven days of denim. So we're gonna move along, and I'm just trying to decide here with um, this jumper. One piece jumper. I cannot tell you what I got it, but again, if I find something similar, I'll put links at the bottom. Um, very cute, lightweight. It has a little um, lace detailing along the top portion and the midsection. And I just thought I'd pair this with a yellow blazer to go with these pumps again. I don't know. I think I was in the mindset of, you know, three ways to wear it, you know, kind of featuring these pumps <laughs> but anyway so I kept those on they the pumps kind of encompass all the shades of blue so um, I just thought that was a cute look now where you would wear this I have worn this jumper into the office before with a blazer I can't remember I think I wore it with a cream or a beige blazer with yes I did with cream high heel platform heels um, but this again I'm doing with the yellow to brighten up the mood the season it's spring it's finally spring what does it feel like in your neck of the woods today it is like 40 degrees it's it's not springing but you know what hey I won't complain God does all things well and if he says it needs to feel like winter in the beginning of springtime I'm not mad y'all, I'm not mad at all. I'm just thankful and grateful to see another spring day. <laughs> and so, moving right along, um, we are going to head into this really beautiful look that I love, this pleated yellow and white skirt. Ladies, this skirt is so vintage. I cannot tell you this is a thrifted skirt I got years and years and years and years ago I'm telling you back in the 80s when they made skirts when they said like um, you know this is gonna be a size 4 or whatever in today's range if you buy clothing that's vintage you know the sizing was totally different so <laughs> this skirt pretty much is a zero in today's terms even though it it said small four but anyway looking down again at the the look um i've paired this with a denim blouse um tie neck tie neck bone tie neck blouse and just cinched it at the waist a little bit again with these pumps because I think that it's just a fun play on texture and print um, let me know down below in the comments if you like to mix your prints um, in that way so I thought this would be another fun look. You can wear this into the office, especially when you're trying to like push the envelope and wear denim. Of course, nowadays we're like post panty. So um, I think pretty much you can like wear whatever you want, but um, in my particular office, I could not get away with like this look that I'm wearing as far as the wash denim or whole denim look, but I could wear a, a denim blouse um, in this way with the skirt. I think this look would also be good for wearing to church on a more low-key Sunday. Say you guys have dressed down Sundays, I would definitely wear this. Or like if you are are um, headed to brunch and you just want to kind of have a little lady-like flair, I think this would be a good look as well in the springtime, okay? So let me know if you're a lover of pleats. I think I've asked this before. Um, do you ladies like pleats? Are you more of a pencil skirt girl? Midi, maxi, right now I know that maxi denim, that's everything. And so I purposefully did not do a maxi denim because everybody and their mother is doing that. So I'm just doing, you know, the alternative uh, denim pieces. So moving right along. This is a cute little weekend look. I've done this before when we, my family and I have gone out to like 
brunch on a Saturday to like, where do we go? Like, like one of those cutesy diners, I can't remember the name, but I actually wore this dress alone. I think I threw it into the dryer a little bit too much or one too many times because the dress is now a shirt to me because I'm trying to be modest here. So um, this past summer, I threw the dress on with um, a little bit of a destroyed white denim. And you'll see here um, that it's just kind of a fun errand look. Like I said, we just hopped like on the fly, decided to go eat at one of those fun um, diners. I don't, it's not a silver diner. I don't know guys, but you know, one of those fun places where they give you really great um pancakes and omelets and all that good stuff so we ate there had the best drink oh my gosh i need to look that up so we can head back there but anyway um i thought that this dress was really cute didn't want to give it up so i added the denim the white denim to kind of brighten up with some flats and so you could do flats you can do trainers um keep it lightweight light and airy i think this is a really fun look let me know down below in the comments what you think about it and then we have i really love this look i really love this look here um it's a i guess it's bell bottoms it's uh, a very good throwback to the 70s that really flat front panel with the gold um buttons and that beautiful romantic blouse i love this look so 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 much and i've paired it with those gold platforms i think that's just an amazing look because when you think of like bell bottoms you know platforms kind of ring from the same era if you will um i went when i went to college in the 90s dating myself I wore looks like this often, so much so that like one of the cafeteria workers was like, oh, here comes Miss 70s. She just loves the 70s, y'all. When I was in college, there was this amazing consignment shop located in Towson, Maryland. I think it's closed, I don't even know. Oh my gosh, they had the best. I got so many amazing pieces from like the 70s from amazing designers and I would put those looks on and I would wear them out and I just knew I I was doing it. Um and so she recognized that in me. She was like, you should have you should have been grown in the 70s. I was like, I'm a 70s baby, okay. But anyway, so this is a fun look. I would definitely wear this out to dinner, to brunch. I would go to the movies. I would catch a like a, a light fun like comedy show that's kind of low key if you're not trying to overdo it and dress up totally um i would definitely wear this look i think the the blouse is so romantic and flirty um definitely wear a cami and a camisole underneath of it beautiful lace camisole because you're gonna see through this kind of material so you just want to have the best ladylike beautiful things underneath that it's that would still um be modest and cover you up um you know because there's a fine line <laughs> i won't go there all right and then this next look so i shared this one one two three four five okay i'm just counting because I'm, I'm looking at what i got here the next look is just a very casual i call this a saturday morning like errands running or coffee with your bff look it's denim on denim as they term it a canadian tuxedo i don't know if we still do that but i love it i love the wash on both of these pieces um and i just thought the pop of green was really kind of cool um to share this look i would definitely wear this um to you know just hop up on a saturday and and meet a good girlfriend or go shopping at the mall just kind of you know regular so let me know down below in the comments if you'd pair i know everyone's doing it but in real life real life real life 
would you pair the denim on denim? Kind of like this look here. Like, I think sometimes when we think of denim on denim, before now, um, I think that we kind of thought like it's just so heavy, it's so hot. But a lot of denim is is more lightweight now, like this chambray, which this top is. But I know even for a fact, I felt like oh, it's just too hot to wear this with that and layer it uh, like a denim jacket and denim jeans. Now, fellas, I know my husband's like, you know, do do men still wear denim? jackets with jeans is that a look still and i'm like yes it's very much a look you i think for guys on the guys side of the house you break it up you can put a fun hoodie inside of it throw on those those nike whatever you decide to wear um but i do think for the ladies you can layer it um just choose when you're gonna wear because sometimes denim can get kind of heavy not so much as hot i think but heavy so anyway, um, I think chambray top, if you're doing the lightweight denim um, look, that would be perfect when you're further into spring, when it's warmer or um, earlier in the daytime. But of course, you know, those cooler spring nights, it doesn't even matter. Throw on, layer, and you know, layering is good. Layering is good anytime, I think, as long as you can peel it off when you start to heat up. So. Let me move on, let me move on. I think we're at the last look here. And this is just a simple, and like I said before, chambray. This is a simple, um, lightweight denim dress. This dress has seen the world. <laughs> I got this dress many moons ago and I love it. It is a staple in my wardrobe for every spring and summer. If I could wear this dress in the winter time, I probably would. It's so comfy. It is ideal for a weekend, just ripping and running, the things that we do as moms and wives, um, when you're just trying to be low key. I have worn this with flip flops, sandals, uh, trainers. I've worn this even as a, not really like a jacket, but I've worn it open layered with other pieces i just love it love it love it y'all you would not believe where i got this dress from i want to say i got it from sears way back in the day like are there even sears and robux stores open anymore but anyway this was when you know sears was putting out really nice stuff <laughs> i feel crazy saying that and no offense to anyone like i Sears had me in a chokehold for a while because I think they were trying to transition over and they were like merging with Kmart for a while and they had these amazing cotton pieces that I am totally telling you reminded me of Express um, their shorts I got a lot of shorts and blazers at that time and I'm telling you, I was like, are we sure we're not an Express or the Limited even? Uh, those really fun cotton, you know, those fitted blazers and the shorts that they still make now. So anyway, but that's where this dress came from. I have had her for years. I'm telling you, I had this dress before I had my daughter. And my daughter will be 18 in May. This dress is almost 20 years old, y'all. So anyway, <laughs> I just wanted to share that with you all wanted to share these looks now let me know below in the comments what you thought of uh how i shared these looks maybe how you would tweak them a little bit tell me what color denim you prefer in spring and summer i was watching a youtube video earlier and someone even mentioned that she she still liked black denim now i think black denim in spring and summer are still ideal um for nighttime like if you're going out to dinner going to a movie a show and you're still trying to be kind of sleek and sexy you know how we do ladies so but let me know down below in the co comments. Oops, sorry. Uh, right now, there are various shades of denim because denim is a hot, hot trend right now. Uh, I've seen gray. I've seen tan brownish kind of um, denim. 
I've seen pink washes as we know um, those really fun cargo denim pants were in all the colors sorry guys somebody is just texting me all over but anyway I just wanted you guys to um, comment below as I said I'm distracted comment down below um, your thoughts on this video on these looks uh, whether you would try them out whether you've been doing it for years like I have um, don't forget to like comment save share and also please 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 visit my socials I'm on Instagram Facebook TikTok. I have a website what to wear here and there dot com uh, you can shop my looks at like to know it on the app there and i'm also over at mode sense um influencing there as well as express you can shop with me there's a link if you go to my website all of the links are there below um but just you know stay along for the ride i am just loving the new subscribers uh and your comments that you are sharing with me i hope that you are sharing with your friends so that you can bring them along we could just have a big old fun party together sitting here laughing and uh talking about uh style um high low style with flair don't forget that so again, I am Lashana and I love you from my heart for being here with me. And until the next time, bye for now.